Doctors around the country are beginning to see more patients with late stage cancers, and many believe it's due to delayed screenings during the COVID pandemic. Here to talk about this concerning trend is Dr. Brett Parkinson, Medical Director of Intermountain Healthcare's Breast Care Center. Dr. Parkinson, we're coming up next month, October, is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. We always tell people this time of year, be certain to get your annual screenings. However, people have not been. You've seen some delayed action. Let's talk about that. You know, I'm, I'm glad you brought that up for a couple of reasons. First of all, when screening was paused last year for about six weeks here at Intermountain Medical Center, as it was elsewhere around the country, um, women did not uh, come in for their mammograms because they couldn't. So if they just delayed six or eight weeks, that's not such a big deal because we don't think that that in the ultimate scheme of things really matters that much. What we worry about is those patients who actually skip their screenings because of COVID, because they thought, you know, I, I can't come in during that period of time or I'm a little frightened because of COVID. And so they put it off for a year and they think, well, I'll just do it next year and it will be fine. Well, you know what? It's not fine because for those women who may have had a cancer that was small but growing, a year could make a big difference to their staging and ultimately to their survival. Wow, you know, Dr. Parkinson, we know catching cancers early, no matter what the cancer, that is key to curing it. If a breast cancer is found right now, we are still in the middle of this pandemic. We've also been told that surgeries are being put on hold, non-essential surgeries. What if there is a breast cancer? Can those women still get the surgery immediately or within a, a fairly quick time? Absolutely, as I've mentioned before on this program, uh, we do same day biopsy. So if a woman comes in with a lump or she comes back from a screening mammogram with an abnormality, we can do the biopsy the same day. Um, surgeries for breast cancer are still being done. The surgeries that are being postponed now or canceled are surgeries that require an overnight stay that are not emergent. So most breast cancer surgeries, in fact, almost all breast cancer surgeries do not require an overnight stay, even if there's a mastectomy. So there's no worry. Those women right now can get the surgical treatment they need, and then they can proceed with other treatments as deemed necessary, like radiation therapy or chemotherapy. We are also open here in our breast care center. We're doing screenings. We're doing diagnostics for women who have lumps. So there is no excuse for women not to come in. We have a mask requirement here at the hospital. We are social distancing, and we are, of course, cleaning our equipment in between patients so this is a very safe place to be. Everyone's in good hands there at the hospital. Dr. Parkinson, really quickly, go over the requirements or who should be thinking, gosh, yeah, I need to go get screened myself. What are the requirements? Well, any woman who is at average risk for breast cancer should have a screening mammogram beginning at age 40 every year for as long as they are healthy. Now, women who are at extremely high risk, who may have a family history of breast cancer or ovarian cancer, or who carry one of the breast cancer genes, may want to be screened with breast MRI. Right now, that's expensive, but we're working on a program to bring down the cost here at Intermountain Healthcare and bring down the time of the examination. It's called abbreviated MRI. So that's one thing that we're really looking forward to in this next year. That's fantastic. I do want to urge everyone, along with you, Dr. Brett Parkinson, to tell you to go out, get your mammogram. If you have questions or concerns, even if it's about finances of a mammogram, call Intermountain Healthcare. They will help you out in any way they can because they know it's so important. We will put all of this information plus more on our website, fox13now.com, under the Wellness Wednesday tab. Dr. Brett Parkinson with Intermountain Healthcare, Breast Care Department. Thank you so much. Look forward Thank to you. celebrating all the survivors next month in Breast Cancer Awareness Month.